Okay, what's up YouTube? It's Richie from Boston. And I am inside my new Hilleberg tent. This is a uh, Kamjati. I don't know how I just said that. Two. And this is me. I'm 5'11", 240 pounds. And this is a two-person tent. And there is plenty of room. No doubt. Setting this temp tent up was a snap. It's two poles. Two poles that go the entire distance of the tent from side to side. I'll adjust the name. It's a Namjot. I don't know how you say it. N-A-M-M-A-J-T-I-2. It's not the GT with the vestibule, but it does have, has great zippers. These are YKKs. It has a very spacious vestibule on its own. That's more than big enough for a dog two backpacks or whatever it is that you might need for your trip. I just set this up, so I still need to learn how to tighten it and all that other stuff. But setting this up was actually quite the snap. As you can see, I'm sitting up, upright. I mean, I'm crouching, so I'm on my knees, so I'm up pretty good. I also have a, a uh, a mountain hardware tangent 2 and this is the replacement for it it's got plenty of uh i'm on the ocean right now so it is very windy and this has full mesh no sam mesh it's yellow so it's nice and light in here which is something that you really like something i like I'm not feeling the wind whatsoever. It is windy as heck outside too, as you can see by the tent blowing everywhere. And again, I just set this up for the first time ever. So, this is a Hilleberg. I don't know how to say it. Nimjit 2. Nice big vestibule. Sorry, crawling out of it. And this is the black edition, so this is the Four Season tent. Let's set this down. I set this up as well as I could for the first time ever. Plenty of guidelines. It has the speed uh, adjustments on it. So all you have to do is simply pull it out, give it a little tension. It has full tensioners on all the straps, which are nice, and all the way around the base of the tent itself. You can see it's pretty windy out today. I don't know if I have this set up perfectly as of yet because it's a new tent oh, I see this is wire I got you it's wire there you go simply bend the wire plenty of airflow plus you can zipper that close on the inside which is nice also speed adjusters all the way around at every peg and it comes with some really nice high-speed Hilleberg tent spikes. These are just like uh, the groundhogs. All in all, this is a serious tent. There's Hilleberg, so I'm pretty excited. And I guess I'll set this up against my tangent and see which affords more room, but I'm going to tell you right now, this bad boy definitely gives you more room. What's the name? There it is. It's a Nam 
N-A-M-M-A-T-J-2. And if you get the GT, it has the extended uh, vestibule right here. I'm not sure if you can zip that right on, but just the way it stands, it works for me. And you can also take the skin off in the summer, springtime, and have a completely enclosed mesh tent, which is beautiful. My mountain hardware does that as well, so I'm going to leave this up overnight and let the wind really get to it. You can see Boston Harbor's right over there. So we get some serious wind in the Atlantic's right over there. Anyways, I don't know how to say it, but it's a Hilleberg Namat 2. I'm going to I'm going to go with that. Anyways, guys, I think this retails for about uh 800 I picked it up slightly used I mean it works beautiful you simply pop together the two two poles they slide right through the bracket they slide right through the uh, this sewn in area and then they sit down right here in these little leather boots and then that's it that's it the tent is up I just laid it down, rolled it out, put two pegs in, rolled it out, put the poles in, and then went around and attached the guy lines. I mean, it really can't get any easier than that. That was nice. I'll tell you what, it's a lot quicker than putting up the mountain hardware. Anyways, Richie from Boston, guys. Get out there while you still can.